Welcome inside the Whittemore Center where the UNH Wildcats men's hockey team takes on the Merrimack College Warriors here in Durham tonight for a 7 p.m. puck drop. Stay tuned for game action. I will join you after the first period. Three on one developing from the right side. Love it shot. Glove down by Robinson. Follow up from the slot. Forehand shot save. Rebound score. It's red circle. Sets up hallway for a blast and he scores. Well, after the first 20 minutes of play here at the Whittemore Center, the ice has tilted in Merrimack College's favor, leaving UNH at a two-goal deficit. And here's a chance for Jeffries near circle. Turn, shoots, kick, save, rebound, Brar score. Walsh on side, great pass the other way, shot scored, Vanell from the left circle. Merrimack College has found a way to double their lead against the Wildcats, now leading 4-0. Physical period between those two teams, but the Wildcats knew that this was going to be a competitive game coming in. Left circle, forehand shot save, rebound, Jeffries jabbed at it, but the right pad of Robinson cut off the post. He'll skate in right side, he cuts inside, he shoots, it hit the post, it's still loose, follow up shot, score! A bit of a momentum change in the third period for the Wildcats, but despite their hard fought efforts, the Warriors came out on top tonight, five to two. Head coach Mike Souza and forward Eric McAdams are downstairs addressing the press. Let's head in to see what they say. You know, we haven't practiced a ton, which is not, not an excuse at all, but um, certainly gotta flip the switch as a group. Yeah, I'm sure they're going to be excited, feeling good about themselves. I, you know, I think they've been, I talked to Scott yesterday. I think they've been close, you know, for a couple of weeks. They obviously uh, got the job done tonight. So, yeah, we have to, we have no choice but to flip the switch. Yeah, it's just a matter of us playing to our standards. The guys that have been here a while know what those are. When we're playing to those standards, we're a good team. And, and we're not talented enough to not play to the, that level or those standards. And uh, when we don't consistently, it shows the way we played in the third. I thought we were all we were on our toes and we were getting we were getting good bodies. We were getting pucks low and shots to the net. I mean, and we got to continue that to the drop of the puck tomorrow and continue it for 60 minutes too. Again, we we're just we need to play to our identity all the time. Doesn't matter if it's Olympic or a smaller sheet, but tomorrow will definitely be more physical with a smaller sheet and um, there's going to be shots from everywhere. So you got you got to be ready at all times. The Wildcats are back in action to complete the second game of the home and home series tomorrow afternoon at 4 p.m. at Lawler Arena against Merrimack College. For UNH Wildcat Productions, I'm Natalie Norrie.